Bells were ringing today in downtown Buffalo, but this wedding is truly a bittersweet one. Talk about a collision of emotions. Mm -hmm. You see, Roswell Park threw the wedding so that a man diagnosed with terminal cancer would be able to see his daughter get married. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Rusak brings us a truly beautiful story. You'll see only on 7. From this day forward. <laughs> for better or worse. For better or for worse. Those Amen. special words mark the beginning Minister. of a lifelong bond. For Alina and Adam, their lifelong bond began a few weeks earlier than planned and on the opposite side of the country. This impromptu wedding all came about after one phone call. Last month we get a call from my mom saying that they think my dad has cancer. It's stage four. There's an artery that's surrounded by cancer which can make his heart stop at any minute, which means he can't fly. Some quick thinking and a lot of help from the Roswell Park Cancer Institute, and a wedding was planned. Angel Borgos only had to travel down an elevator to walk side by side with his daughter and hand her away. When I got the announcement of having cancer, I never, th I didn't get so broken down than when I had the announcement that my daughter came here to get married today. Hey now kiss your bride and bride when they kiss your husband. This wasn't just a show for Angel. Alina and Adam are now legally wed after an exchange of vows, cutting of cake, and a father-daughter dance this family will never forget. And at least I had the opportunity to have a dance with her and give her away. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Those words, they are special. And for this family, those words are already put to the test. In Buffalo, Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News.